Sharif Ismail held meeting on Saturday with the aviation minister Sharif Fathi to discuss a number of files and plans concerning the aviation sector. The meeting tackled also the outcomes of the minister's latest visit to Ghana as well as enhancing Egypt's relations with a number of countries. Ismail also held another meeting with the transport minister Hisham Arafat to review the ongoing projects implemented by the ministry of to develop the railways, underground and metro. The high-ranked officials followed the memorandum of agreement uh, signed in the sidelines uh, of the President Abdel Fattah Sisi's visit to France, as well as different aspects of cooperation between Egypt and the other countries. It's also expected that the Prime Minister will hold a number of meetings during the day with a number of ministers to study the outcome of President Al-Sisi's visit to France related to each ministry and means of enhancing the bilateral ties. The meetings also is to tackle the preparations for the World Youth Forum due to be held next week in Sharm el-Sheikh. Resuming their efforts to fight terrorism, law enforcement troops of the 3rd Field Army detained the three terrorists in Sinai. The security forces seized a 4x4 jeep and a mount of explosive elements used in bombs hidden in a cave in a mountain in, in, the, in central Sinai. Army spokesperson uh, Gen um, Brigadier Temer Fai said that they also uh, seized four motorbikes and a small truck carrying a huge amount of motorbike suppliers which was on its way to the terrorists. Al-Azhar condemned the terrorist attack targeted a Bahraini police bus on Friday. In a statement, Al-Azhar uh, expressed its full support to Bahraini government facing these terrorist attacks. Al-Azhar added that these attacks aim at spreading chaos and to destabilize the kingdom. From its part, the uh, Gulf Cooperation Council, the GCC, also condemned the attack, calling the international community to stop the powers uh, boosting and funding such terrorist organizations. Earlier on Friday, terrorists attacked um, a Bahrain uh, police bus near an area outside the capital Manama, killing a policeman and wounding eight others. The Bahrain Interior Ministry said that uh, eight wounded policemen sustained serious to medium injuries were admitted to hospital. The incident was the latest in a series of attacks targeting policemen in Bahrain. Giza Criminal Court will issue its verdict on 11 defendants charged in violence incidents in Kurdasa area, which uh, were witnessed in December 2014. On another judicial front, uh, Cairo Criminal Court resumes the trial of uh, 213 members of the so-called Ansar al-Qaeda convicted of terrorist acts against police, army and state institutions. And uh, Britain urged the UN Security Council to impose sanctions on Syria after a UN-led investigation found the government forces were responsible for the sarin gas attack on Khan Sheikhoun. A joint UN organization